the dance of the stars. Once upon a time, on a clear and peaceful night, there were two little sisters named Vida and Azul. That night, the moon was shining brighter than ever, and the stars seemed to be dancing in the sky. Vida and Azul peeked out of their bedroom window, fascinated by the spectacle. Suddenly, a shooting star passed by the window, leaving a bright trail in its wake. But instead of disappearing over the horizon, the star began to slowly descend until it landed in the girl's garden. Filled with excitement, Vida and Azul ran to the garden. When they arrived, they saw that the star had left a trail of golden dust leading to a small lake hidden among the trees. Without hesitation, the little sisters followed the trail until they reached the lake. But this was no ordinary lake. Its waters shimmered as if made of thousands of stars. As they approached, one of the stars in the water began to rise, and before their amazed eyes, it transformed into a beautiful, glowing dancer. Hello, little explorers, said the dancer with a kind smile. I am Starlina, the guardian of the Dance of the Stars. Tonight, I invite you to join our special celebration. Vida and Azul, filled with joy, took Starlina's hands, and suddenly, they found themselves floating above the lake, surrounded by thousands of tiny stars dancing around them. Soft, melodic music filled the air, and the girls let themselves be carried by the rhythm, twirling and laughing as the stars accompanied them in their dance. As they danced, the stars whispered secrets about the universe to the sisters, stories of distant galaxies and magical planets where dreams come true. Vida and Azul felt happier and freer than ever before. After a while, Starlina stopped the dance and said, it's time to return, my dear friends. But remember, you can always find me in the sky, and when you close your eyes to sleep, you can dance with the stars in your dreams. With one last spin, Vida and Azul found themselves back in their garden, right where it all began. The lake and Starlina had disappeared, but the golden dust still sparkled in their hands. Back in their bed, Vida and Azul hugged each other, feeling the warmth of their adventure in their hearts. They knew that every time they looked at the night sky, the stars would be waiting for them for another magical dance. And so, with smiles on their faces, Vida and Azul closed their eyes and drifted into a sleep filled with stars, dances, and the gentle melody of the universe. The end.